Hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back for another rock hunting adventure today. Oh. <laughs> so we're... Oh, dang it. <laughs> hey, what's up everybody? Welcome back for another video today. Teaming up with Rob from Michigan Rocks. Hello. So we're going rock hunting with another buddy. His name's Thomas. He's a brand new YouTube channel and he's... Ah, dang it. <laughs> it was going so well. It was going so good. Dang it. <clears throat> Now I got the laughs. Thomas from 99 Rock Hounding, but he doesn't know I'm coming with. He thinks he's just rock hounding with Rob today. So we're gonna surprise him. So let's go do that. All right, we're pulling up at Thomas's place. He doesn't know I'm in the car. I don't think this isn't the right one. <laughs> <laughs> wrong house. I'm trying to be sneaky, hiding down. <laughs> we went to the wrong house. <laughs> I'm hiding in the car. This is so uncomfortable, buried down in the car. Who's in my car? Who's that? Hey! What's up, man? How's it going? Good, how about you? I'm doing good, it's nice to meet you. You too, man. We decided to surprise. Yeah. Wow, that is a surprise. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so like I said, we're gonna be doing some rock hunting with Rob, Michigan Rocks, and Thomas. He's got a brand new channel, 99 Rock Hounding. I'm gonna put both of their links to their channels in the description box below. Please go check them out and subscribe if you haven't done so yet. So today we're in a beautiful river in Minnesota. We're gonna do some agate hunting. Thomas is gonna be doing some trout fishing, so if he catches anything good, we'll be showing that as well. So let's get our feet wet and see what we can find today. Got our first find right here. It's a beautiful little turtle. <laughs> oh, cute. Put my finger. Look how little he is. <laughs> That's sweet. All right, okay, good luck. Oh, well, that's embarrassing. <laughs> <laughs> I just picked this one up, and I know agates can be different from different areas, but Thomas, what do you think of this? That definitely looks agate -y. It's got the pits. Yeah. It's got kind of... It's got quartz. Like some banding, too. Yeah. Let me... I got a scrub brush in my bag. Let me... After I find some more stuff, we'll get this cleaned up, and we'll take a closer look and see if it's a positive ID or not. So this river is absolutely beautiful, but I gotta say... This is colder than anything I've felt in Lake Superior all year. <laughs> That's a nice piece of quartz. Not what we're looking for today. We're looking for Lake Superior agates in this beautiful river. And some jasper. There's so much material to look for. We'll find some stuff. Thomas has found some pretty good stuff in this river in his first video. I'll put the link to that in the, in the description box below. Well, might have found one right here. Get some sunlight. Ah, it's just quartz. All right, we'll keep looking. <laughs> My B-roll shot. So I think I found the first uh, possible agate. Do you want to see it in the river? Uh, yes. All right. So this is the suspect right here, and it looks like it's glowing, and it doesn't have as much algae compared to the ones around it. As you can see, like, right there. And it's got some pitting. So I'll have Rob come up and take a peek at it. It's right there. It's kind of oh, glowing. Yeah. Yep. So. Get it in some sunlight here. Oh, look at it glow. I'm trying to see any visible bands. Might just be a quartz knot. You can see quartz right there. Maybe some banding right there. We'll get it cleaned off with that other one here and we'll take a look at both those real quick. All right, so we got these cleaned up. This one, it's like a quartzy nodule. You can see it glow in there in my hand. So I'll get that put in the bag here. Then the big guy. 
Verdict is in. It's an agate. All right. It's got some plumy moss action going on, some quartz. It's, as with all the big agates I find, it's not the prettiest. But that's an agate. You can see it glowing. That is so crazy. Right here. That's where I'm... This right here, that is what's leading me to think agate. You can see like the plumy moss going on in there. That is really cool. That's funny. That's enormous. And I've had it in my hand or in my bag this whole time. <laughs> that is cool. Sweet. All right, so I found this guy. I think it might be a nodule. It looks, to dry it off, it's got that potato skin. So I'm pretty sure that this is a nodule. This might be one to cut. But then, straight ahead of me, I spotted this glower right in there. It's tiny, it's just a little guy. And then, right below me, right here, this piece of red elytic jasper. Huh, maybe. I'd say, what do you think? Yeah, I'd call that Uidic Jasper. Yeah, that's pretty. Very Uidic Jasper. <laughs> Got a biggie? Oh my gosh. You guys want to... <laughs> All right, we just found... This is probably one of the best agates I've found in a long time. You can barely see it running through there. And the reason I knew it was, I just spotted it and I grabbed Rob's bucket here. And... Uh, I put it down over it and it cleared it up. You might not be able to see it because the reflection. Oh, it's so bad. We'll just grab it and show you. But check this agate out with all those bands. Wow. Oh my gosh. Wow. Oh my goodness. <laughs> this is one of the best Lake Superior agates I've ever found. Thank you, Thomas, for bringing us here. Welcome. Oh I my! Keep everything that everyone finds. <laughs> <laughs> nice. Oh my nice gosh! Job. That's awesome. Ear to ear, right now. Oh I knew there man. would be some around here because I missed in those current spots. Those <laughs> Let me give this a little scrub. It's got a bunch of algae and stuff on it, and we'll get in some little bit better light. Sorry about that. And we'll show you these bands. Told you there was good stuff in here. Oh, I believed you. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, got her cleaned up. Thomas was letting me know we gotta clean in some citric acid to really make it pop, but check out those bands. All the way around. Comes down through here, some conchoidal, conchoidal fracturing into there. And right there. Oh, what a beauty. <laughs> yes. It's sometimes shinier than this because yeah, it's got that oil on it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> so I'm getting a, a little education right now on poison ivy because I, I was watching one of Thomas's videos and he pointed out poison ivy and I said, uh, surprisingly, I have no idea what it looks like. So um, you guys got to point it out to me and we found some. So now I know. And now you guys know if you didn't know. The more you know. How many times can I say no in one sentence? So we're going to put the bucket on there and we'll see. I'm almost thinking no. I saw the shadow, the shadow looked brown, so I thought maybe it's quartz. Yeah. But it's like quartz of banding and it's just quartz. So, ah. We'd have done this probably 100 times today, picking up stuff, and it ends up being nothing we're looking for today, but that's how you find the good stuff. That's a, that's a project here. I don't know. He blends in so well. I know. I don't know where he went now. <laughs> I've had a few kick my legs today. There's a lot Yeah, there he is. Woodpecker. Way up there. That's huge. Almost see the bird expert. <laughs> I almost see the red. That's cool. Thomas just found an egg here. Let's take a peek at that. Oh. That is nice. I'm excited to get that one cleaned off. Oh, too. yeah. Got that river burn. Yep. You hear the Pelea Woodpecker. He's laughing at me. <laughs> <laughs> nice find. Thank you. All right, so I found this. Red jasper a little bit ago on a bank of this river here. It's really pretty. And I think I might have spotted some more jasper right there. It's a pretty decent size. 
grab that. And uh, oh, that's heavy. Get cleaned off and up. Lining's not the best right now, but yeah, that's uh, it's like some banded jasper. That's pretty cool. I'm gonna leave that though. Long walk back. It's a little too heavy for me today. Oh, two hits. There's some more jumping up ahead. Got ourselves an Omar right here. Nice. I just gave Thomas an Omar today, so I'm I'm even. Oh, and a couple inches away. The lake's very not the biggest, but got some bands on there. That's cute. So we've been walking a little bit. I got caught on this bank right here and they're up there looking and look what I found. Nice agate. <laughs> Looks like a limonite stained one. So funny. That is pretty. <laughs> That's pretty cool. So I have found two Omars. There's one right here. It's like a lot of it's missing. That's really cool. And then there's another one. I spotted it from all the way over there. Yeah. I am in the green on Omar's today. Can I do this in your video? <laughs> <laughs> He's ripping some beautiful jewelry. Oh, wow. <laughs> Alrighty, so we're at the end of the hunt and we had an absolute blast. Huge thanks to Thomas for bringing us out here. He didn't film today because he let us hunt. So if you guys can do me a huge favor, go subscribe to 99 Rock Hounding. His channel link is going to be in the description box below. If you haven't checked out Michigan Rocks, please go check him out as well. Same thing, channel link in the description box below. Had an absolute blast. Thank you guys so much for watching. Bye. 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 <laughs> <laughs> Okay, you ready? Yeah. <laughs> this is so bad. This is so awkward. All those people at the party are like, what are they doing? I can't do it. <laughs> oh, I'm, sure, it I'm sure we got something. Okay.